Greetings, legends. The Reds are coming. It's time to check out what's new. This update introduces the new Red Navy with Russian cruisers, early access to the Russian destroyers, and the war and peace campaign. Let's check them out. The Russian cruisers are an interesting bunch, featuring radar at higher tiers and magnificent flat shooting guns that are perfect for long distance combat. Most of the cruisers also carry extremely fast and deadly short range torpedoes, good for moments of glory or surprise. With these weapons, they have the tools to fight at any distance, but be careful, they lack the armor to survive in the mid-range. There's a new campaign to go along with the Red Navy, War and Peace. Gather rewards en route to the definitive Russian cruiser, Mikhail Kutuzov. This cruiser is bringing a lot to the table. Long-range 6-inch guns with excellent ballistics, a smoke generator and sonar. This makes the Mikhail Kutuzov a great damage dealer. Russian destroyers make their way into the battle. The Russian destroyers Izaslav, Podvoysky, Genevny and Minsk are available through early access to this update and are attainable through containers. These fast gunboats can outshoot most enemy destroyers, but might struggle up close due to their glacially slow turrets. That's where their torpedoes come in handy. Naturally, there are six new commanders joining Anton Gurian in the roster to place at the helm of the new ships. There are four new premium ships on the way as well. Two join the Red Navy, the Tier 5 cruiser Molotov and the Tier 4 battleship Imperator Nikolai I. The other two are part of the Royal Navy. At Tier 5 is the destroyer Gallant and the battleship Monarch joins at Tier 7, available for global XP. Hmm, I wonder what else is coming. Well, that's a lot of new ships in this update, Legends. Give them a try and turn the tide.